Hi and welcome to HUDKing.com, your source for real virtual tours in HUD homes in and around the San Antonio area. If you're watching this on HUDKing.com, click on the bird to follow us on Twitter, click on the F to follow us on Facebook, or click on the YouTube link to be taken to our YouTube page. While you're at our YouTube page, if you click on the subscribe button, you'll be instantly notified of new uploaded videos. Now on to the home. We are here in Mission Del Lago West at 802 Lee Trevino. That's 802 Lee Trevino. And this is a fantastic property. It's a four bedroom, two and a half bath home, approximately 2587 square feet. It was built in 2013 and it sits on a nice cul-de-sac. So the lot is quite large. It's on a 13,000 square foot lot. Best of all, this home is about $35,000 underneath the county appraisal. It's not very often we see relatively new homes with that kind of equity under the county appraisal. The exterior of this home is a combination of brick and hardy plank. Exterior-wise, in really good condition. I mean, it almost doesn't need anything on the exterior. You have this large side here, and you're probably not going to have any neighbors behind you because of the way that the lot is situate, situated, which is very nice. Privacy down at the end of the street. Mission Del Lago has a nice golf course over here. Let's take a look at the backyard, then the inside. We step into the backyard from the breakfast area. You can see it has a very nice covered patio here. And because it's at, uh, at the end of a cul-de-sac, you have sort of an irregularly shaped lot, but it's still very large. It's about double the size of a normal lot. And I'm gonna come over here and show you what's back behind this lot. So you'll see that you have an easement back there. You're probably not gonna have any neighbors right up behind you, which is really nice great buy for the money. Not only that, but in the month of July 2017, HUD is doing a $100 down payment for owner-occupant buyers getting an FHA loan to buy this home. Let's see, over here it looks like the only thing it really might need is a fresh coat of paint. You can see some of the paint is coming off of the siding there. Looks like they may have had a little barbecue pit out here, but really very minor thing to, to address. Let's look at the inside. Well, stepping into the home, we are immediately into a formal, I guess this could be a formal living room right up front. You could use it as a formal dining if you want. If we look down on the floor, there's ceramic tile on the entryway, which I always think is nice. If you have carpet right when you walk into your home and your shoes are wet or duddy, dusty or muddy, they're gonna get the carpet pretty dirty. So if we turn to the left here, we have a half bath, which is nice. Single vanity, commode, a pretty basic room, needs a fresh coat of paint. It has ceramic tile in there, which is very nice. Directly to the left of that, we have your two-car garage, a pretty standard two-car garage. One thing I did notice is if you look up right here, I'm not sure if you can tell, there's a little bit of water penetration. You might want to have the roof examined right there at the eave where it connects with the second story. It looks like there might be a little bit of water penetration. A big perk is this is bedroom number one, which is the master bedroom and master bath, which is downstairs. I think that's a great, if you get a two-story home and your master bedroom is downstairs, it's definitely a plus. It's gonna need some carpeting. Come over to the master bath. Master bath has these really nice dual vanity countertops here. And it has a separate garden tub and shower. Has ceramic tile on the floor. And then your master walk-in closet. It's a good sized closet. So all the home really needs right now, let me tell you, is a fresh coat of paint, a tiny bit of sheetrock repair, and some flooring, whether you're gonna come back with wood or carpeting, because the carpeting I don't believe can be salvaged. Now we go through the formal living room. You have a little storage here underneath the staircase that takes you upstairs. Then we're into your main family room here. It's gonna need a fresh coat of paint and some flooring. To the left here we have your kitchen. It has granite countertops, which is nice. You have ceramic oversized tile in the breakfast area here. You'll have a little table, which is probably where you eat most of your meals. And then your big open kitchen. Now, some of the cabinets are damaged, so you're gonna to wanna to probably repair or replace these cabinets here. And then this is missing a cabinet door. Could be a style that they had. They, they might have removed a the door there just to kind of give it that open look, but it does have granite countertops. You'll need to put in the, um, the appliances. It doesn't have any appliances. We'll come over to your pantry here and doubles over as your laundry room. So your washer and dryer connections are here along with your pantry. The home is set up for a gas or electric range, which is nice. Make our way upstairs. A little bit of sheetrock damage, as I said. You're going to want to replace the carpeting. Now, as we get upstairs, if we turn to the left here, we have bedroom number two. Really good sized bedroom. Bedroom number two is going to need a fresh coat of paint and some flooring. Let me come over to this window and I'll show you your lot if you decide to buy this home. So you see it's got a really nice size lot. Good sized bedroom. Continue down the hallway to the left here. We have bathroom number two. 
Bathroom number two is gonna need a fresh coat of paint, but you don't need to put any flooring in because it does have ceramic tile on the floor, which is nice. Bedroom number three, another really good sized bedroom, needs a fresh coat of paint and some flooring. And bedroom number four, which is going to need a fresh coat of paint and some flooring. Now if we come over here, you can see an elevated view of that backyard, that easement, and how there's probably not gonna be any neighbors back behind you, which is definitely nice. And then we come over and we have a large upstairs second living area. So you can see they had a wall mounted TV here. You probably wanna either go put your TV over that or patch that hole up, but really big size space. This is a great home, guys. Let me give you a summary. Well, there you have it, 802 Lee Trevino. That's 802 Lee Trevino in the Mission Del Lago West community, just south of San Antonio on the Gulf community. This is a very nice four bedroom, two and a half bath, two story home. Almost 2,600 square feet sits on that large cul de sac lot. And more, most importantly, is about $35,000 underneath the county appraisal. It's listed right now for only $170,000. So if you're interested in this home and you don't have a realtor, I would love to earn your business. You can reach me at 210-706-0616. My name is Jonathan. I am the HUD King, and I want to help you find your castle.